What are the limitations of whole genome sequencing? The specific technology used to sequence your genome is called next-generation sequencing, or NGS. NGS can detect most types of variations, but not all of them. For example, Variations that cause DNA repetitions or rearrangements can't be detected by NGS. This means you may have a variant that could predispose you to a certain genetic condition that isn't detected by NGS. Also, occasionally, a portion of a gene may not be readable by NGS, and a variant may be missed. We use public and private databases, as well as medical literature to analyze your genome, and we focus on thousands of genes. As the scientific community continues to make progress, we will continue to learn about more genes and variations. Therefore, you may have variants identified by NGS that are not currently included in your report, but may be revealed at a later date. We will let you know when there are updates available. We report on harmful or potentially harmful variants, variants that are benign or variants of uncertain significance called VUS, are not included in your report. A supplemental file of these variants is available upon request. We currently don't provide a raw data file. However, for a small fee, we can provide you with a file with all your variants called a variant call file, or VCF. Please remember that whole genome sequencing is a screening test for healthy adults and shouldn't be used to diagnose a particular illness or condition. If you have concerns about the possibility of a genetic condition for you or your family, please discuss the option of disease-specific genetic testing with your physician or a genetic counselor.